whether the purpose of your Google Ads campaign is for sales, leads or other activities, you should measure your return on investment to make sure that the money you are spending on Google Ads is working for your business. Hello, I'm Uzair and in this video, I'm going to talk you through how ROI works. Return on investment is a comparison of your net profits to the money spent. This is one of the most important measurements for a Google ad campaign, as it shows the real effects that your ads are having on your business. The exact method for calculating ROI will vary depending on the objectives for your campaign. Let's look at an example. If you have a product that costs 10 pounds to make and sells for 20, as a result of your Google Ads campaign, you sell six of these products. Your total cost is 60 pounds and your sales are 120. If your Google Ads cost 20 for a total cost of 80, ROI is 120 minus 80 divided by 80 pounds equals 50%. With these figures, you have a 50% return on investment. So you are earning one pound 50 for every one pound spent. If the aim of your business is to generate leads, the revenue would be the amount of money that you generally make on each lead. So for example, if you make 10 sales for every 100 leads and your typical sale is 200, then each lead generates approximately 20 pounds in revenue. This is also known as cost per action. Why does ROI matter? When you calculate your ROI, you will be able to work out how much money you have made by advertising with Google Ads and to make decisions about your future budget. How do we track ROI? The first thing we need to do is to measure the conversions. These are actions from your audience that you consider to be valuable, such as email signups, web page visits, sales, or to generate new leads. Google Ads has a conversion tracking tool that helps you to identify how many clicks have led to a conversion. These conversions can help you to evaluate your ROI. You are aiming for the value of each conversion to be greater than the amount of money spent to get the conversion. Hope you enjoyed this video. Thanks for joining in and I hope to see you in my next video.